What's going on guys? Welcome back to Mario and Luigi Superstar Saga plus Bowser's Minions. The Minion Quest, the search for Bowser. We finished the first world of this game in the last episode. Today, we are moving on to the next area of this game. But before we begin, you guys know the drill. Drop a like on this video and answer the comment question of the day. Last time I asked you guys, what is your favorite cereal? And here are some of the responses that we got. Today's comment question of the day is, what is your favorite color? For me, it's green. It's always been green and it will always be green. Think about it like this green is a color that you see every day it's an attractive color it's a color that brings optimism and hope and happiness just to the one you know that sees the color like if you go outside to a garden of lush and greenery you'll be happy you'll be in a good mood automatically dude for real try it if you're depressed go out and find a nice garden and just enjoy some peace and quiet there and you'll see it works it really does man but yeah we're gonna go ahead and make our way down this pipe and see what we got next what that's it we just go straight to the bean bean kingdom like that i thought there was gonna be an adventure that was gonna unfold where i could see them make their way to a hey it's the kooplings all of them except for ludwig and lemmy did you find him nope can't find him anywhere hey they're back what's up how about you don't you think i would have said something if i found him huh we're the almighty Kooplings. How is this happening? If you don't do something quick, we'll be laughing stock. Yeah, that's right. Ha 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 ha. You guys can't find Bowser. I'm laughing at you right now. Is this your biggest fear, Wendy? Ha ha. What are you freaks doing here? This is our turf. Buzz off. Oh, gosh. They're, they're about to turn into some delicious um, bean stew. I don't know if that's a food. What can you make with beans? Hmm. I don't know. Bean mush? Baby food? I don't know what they could do with them, but there's going to be beans for dinner tonight because these guys aren't going to make it out of here alive, I bet. We've looked all over and haven't found squad. Does this mean Lord Bowser was kidnapped? Hey, don't you dare ignore us. Speak to me. That's so rude. Let's teach these freaks some manners. Gosh, everybody's so egotistical. Uh, Lord Bowser kidnapped. Don't be ridiculous. Oh, look at this, dude. Morton's just knocking him out with his shell. Uh, you wouldn't think it, but he's got a naive side. Just saying, it's possible he's been conned or something. Probably. No, that's not actually what happened. I know what happened, but you don't, Kooplings. I can tell you the story. So, yeah. What are they going to do? Oh, no! You, run away. Just... Just run. Who cares what happened to your buddies? Just run away. Now they're acknowledging them. You looking for trouble, buddy? No, just run. Uh, uh, <clears throat> uh no. Hey, I'm scared. I was just on my way out. My sincerest apologies. Oh, my gosh. The smartest one of the bunch, dude. In any case, there's no point arguing until we catch sight of Lord Bowser. We'll just have to split up and keep searching. That is as pointless as adult pencils used for letters to nobodies. Are you idiots? Deaf or something? Get lost before we... Oh, no! What happened? <gasps> oh my gosh, Fuffle brainwashed them. You know, I was actually thinking about this. Like, I'm gonna I'm gonna hit you guys with a little theory right here. Okay, well, it's not a theory, but it's just something that I was thinking about, but this could explain my theory that I was thinking about. So how come the Kooplings didn't attack Fawful or Cacoletta when they were in Bowser's castle? Like, think about it. They're strong. They could have potentially beat them if they all, you know, collectively gathered up on them and, you know, attacked Cacoletta and Fawful. But instead, they were against Mario and Luigi when they saw their Lord Bowser being possessed by some weird witch. But they didn't do anything about it. But now, this here makes sense. It explains what I was thinking. Because they were working with Cacoletta and Fawful. But this makes sense. They were brainwashed. It is my having of luck that causing our meeting here. The Koopling Seven, it is I who am the king of you now. Now, have the saying of my name. Hey, oh, what's happening? I can't see anything. Keep your lousy magic away from me. <laughs> I had knowing the Kooplings would not go down so easily. Now is happening of plan B. Time for max strength to spread your brains will be washed with 99.9 .9 effectiveness. Percent, obviously, you know what else would it be? Whoa, putting in that orange gas. Whoa, no! <laughs> They're dying. They're choking. What are you doing? It is a thing of amazement. So, Koopling 7, how are you finding my spray of delicious wickedness? Oh, please don't tell me their brain rocks. Oh, all hail Lord Fawful! No! This is crazy! Man, even the Kooplings got brainwashed. Ah, the ringing of that sounds are as sweet as a particular sticky treat. What is it? Tell me. But that Goomba, I am wanting to wash his brain even more than the Kooplings. I suppose I have to forgetting of him of the time that is now. 
Okay, Fafo, go ahead, man. Be your crazy self. Oh, I have to run into him. So, this world has one, two, uh, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine levels. So, we're going to do four in this episode, and then we'll do five in the next episode. Turn up tantrum. So, we got Shy Guy, and we got, um, we got these guys, the troopies. Uh, let me see. What can I do? I could do, huh. Uh, that's a good question. What can I do for formation? Uh, let's see. I will use... So there's no range. I have to figure out. So I guess it's all going to be melee. So I could do like these guys, actually. That's actually going to be pretty good. I'll swap you out. Very nice. And then I don't know if I should be using um, like the hammer bros or not, to be honest. I could just do another one of these guys since I have a fiver. Yeah, let's do that. No, 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 no. Save. So I feel like I should be leveling up the other guys as well because they're three and these guys are five. But I don't know if it's even worth it, man. I'll just continue using two or three. I know one, uh, there's probably going to be a point in the game where I'm going to need to use like all paratroopas, or I mean paragoombas. Oh yeah, there you go. Boom! Knock him out. Alright, let's see how much damage we could do. If I could start killing him, knocking him out real quick, that would be very nice. I'd have hope and faith that I'm going to be able to do this. Denied, sucker boy. Oh yeah, even I'm attacking. Kill that little troopy. Come on, how are we still like not killing them that quickly? I, th I thought this was going to be a battle of evenness. No, denied! There's only two of us left! It's because they're range. I didn't know that shy guys were range, but they are. They throw turnips. It makes sense that it's called turnip tantrum. So we definitely just need melees on this team. I put all uh man, that's that's very silly of me to do. I put them all um flying characters. Okay, let's do this. This should definitely do the trick. All right, let's try it again. Rematch time, sucker boys. This time it's redemption time for this guy, this little Goomba right here. But that's actually pretty nice that this Goomba... Th see what they did? They took the most insignificant character in the Mario realm, and they made him the most desirable character for Fafel to, you know, get back at. You know why? Because he doesn't get brainwashed so easily. There's so much potential, dude. No matter what the world says about you, you have potential. So always believe in yourself. That's the lesson that we gathered here from this, uh, you know, wonderful Goomba who doesn't have a name. Perfect! Defeat all eight enemies. And we got extra 5% EXP, I believe. So yeah, that was the first battle. Pretty easy now that I have all melee characters on my team. And then these troopies are also going to be melee. And then those guys are range. So this is working out pretty nicely. They even have the same, like, style formation that I had. I like that. So it makes it very easy for me. And the fact that wow, we are destroying them. I love it so much. None of them are even doing any like special attacks. And then we kill the captain. Right, what you doing, turn up? What you doing, shy guy? You're trying to hit me with your stupid turnips? Everything in this game is about vegetables, man. Perfect. Increased by 5%. Maybe Nintendo thought this would inspire kids to want to eat vegetables like mushrooms and turnips and beans. And all, and, all, and all sorts of vegetables, I guess. Huzzah! What of our own? Are you okay, soldier? No! Back off! What in Bowser's name? What are you doing? Don't tell me Fafel brainwashed you too. Wait, we're on the same side? Yes! Duh! Whew, thank goodness. You're not brainwashed after all, just slow. You should know whose side someone's on before throwing turnips at them. Listen, jerk. The minions are acting crazy. They've been attacking me. That's why I turn up on mi any minions I ran into. I run into. No questions asked. I see where you're coming from. It's a good thing I'd, uh, I'm a master dodger. That's great, dude. Okay, so our first order of business is to unbrainwash our fellow minions. How are we supposed to do that? We need some kind of, like, repellent to, like, counteract what was happening with them. Yes, it's settled. You're coming with us. It's safer to go as a group than to go it alone. Uh, sure, I'm fine with that. Wow, that was easier than expected. Hooray! I got another ally. Let's try our best, okay? Uh, so that flag, does that mean you're in charge, or is that your, your, your fancy? Yeah, he's in charge. It does! The first one, I mean, I'm the captain of this squad. Huh? I can see your aura. Oh, you can see it too? I wasn't sure at first, but I guess I really do have what it takes. Hmm, you can't see it, it's just the smoke. That's the finest aura of stupidity I've ever seen! Hey, that's not nice! I know, I'll be a captain too. It's a bad idea for you to be the only one. <gasps> Wait, we're gonna have two captains? That's silly! Do you know the, about the power triangle, huh? Yeah, I basically wrote the basics on it. Right, so uh, have you also memorized who's strong against two? Yes, I have. What? Is that different from the power triangle? Give me a minute. Now I feel small and stupid. That's what I thought. Oh, well, let's get going. What? You're not going to tell me the answer? 
uh, certain minions are stronger against certain opponents. I knew that. Whoa, that sounds useful. You shy guy, for example, excel when matches against lack of two and lack of peas. Oh, watch out behind you! Well, it's a well-timed enemy. Not, and then he's gonna use the turn up critical. Oh, nice critical hit! You can find more details on this in the formation menu. Study the guide and practice it. Learn who's strong against two. All oh, right, I know these things. Ah, uh, if the captain is weak, the entire squad is weak as well. Ah, uh, I suppose that's true. Learn the stuff on your own, and your skills will improve. So they don't want to teach me, they're just telling me to learn on my own. Hey, wait just a minute! Exactly, dude! You can't just tell me this! Now what happens now? Aren't you gonna become my captain? Uh, do I have to tell you everything? Come on, let's push forward! Alright, you recruited Shy Guy, you can now make Shy Guy your captain. Okay, cool, so I'm gonna make him my captain right now. And everyone on my team is leveled up again. So he's a ranged character, and it says you can't beat that poker face, the Excel and Evasion, and Plumbling Lakitu's and Lakitu's with the turnups. So I'm assuming we're going to be battling Lakitu's and Lakitu's next. Yep, Lakitu's and, um, uh, well, uh, Troopies. So let's go ahead and switch out to him. He's level 8! Amazing! Um, do I have any more of those guys? I don't. So I might as well use one of him, and then I'll use this guy. There you go. I want to level up the the hammer bro that's level 4, and then actually let me switch out, let me see, do I have any level 4 melee guys? I don't, so I guess everything's good here. I have this level 5, no, 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 he's on the team, very nice. Okay, whatever, that's good. Oh, no, 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 what did I do? I just screwed something up. Okay, we'll put you there. I think this is a good team. Hopefully it works out pretty nicely. And let's go ahead and begin the second battle. And it looks like Fawful's here as well. Oh, look at this! He's actually in the Beat Mini Kingdom. There he is! Fawful! Give us our Lord Bowser back! He's not gonna give him back so easily. Oh my gosh! What? You can see the Bean Bean Castle Town being destroyed? Whoa! This is how it originally got destroyed. They used Fawful bots. This is amazing, dude. This is like just... This is hype. This is leading up to Bowser's Inside Story where Fawful takes over. Oh, yeah. Look at all the amazing robots Fawful has. You actually, you actually fight these things in Bowser's Inside Story. I love how they made a reference to that in this. Pretty nice. Fawful's just, you know, on a roll here. He has, like, these Iron Men doing his dirty work. Man, he should have been the one to have Cackletto working for him, not the opposite way around. Why are you the minion, dude? You're supposed to be the main villain, not the sidekick villain. Don't go in there, no! And they picked me up. All right, Lakitu, what are you doing right now? Leave me alone. Stop grabbing me like that mid-battle. Are you my friend? Lakitu? Shh, I've ever found out. It's uh, curtains for us. Huh? Curtains? Look, you can't go to the village. Or to that village. But that's where the weirdo who kidnapped Bowser is. He might be brainwashing our poor king this very moment. We've got to go rescue him. Sure, but we won't stand much of a chance as we are now. Yup, just a small time Goomba gang. Ah, uh, how could you? Just leave it to me, yeah? What do you mean? What are you gonna do, Lakitu? Well, as you know, the Koopa Cruiser exploded in a glorious fashion. Said explosion scattered the minions all across the Bean Bean Kingdom. It's up to you to find the and recruit the minions before making your final stand. Okay. As for me, I'll scout out where the others are for you. That way you can go recruit them all. How's that sound? That sounds good. Okay, I think I understand. Come on, let's hurry. And he kidnapped him. Wow! What are you doing, Lemmy? Larry? I don't know who that is. Lemmy and Larry, they all confuse me, man. Huh? I overheard some, some good stuff back there. Forget that, Goofy Goomba. You work for me now, Lakitu. I'm putting together an army for the great Lord Fawful. No! Fawful just... Or he should, the, that Lakitu should just die. He should kill himself just so he doesn't have to give up. Sacrifice himself for the greater good. I mean, let's be real here. How many Lakitus die every single day? A lot! How many Mario games are being played with Lakitu in them? And how many Lakitus are being killed? So many! So, I mean, what's another Lakitu added to the list? Master Larry, wait up! No, 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 he's not... Oh my gosh, no, no, come on. What are you doing, man? He's brainwashed. He clearly said Lord Fawful, obviously. So, yeah, here we got the Lakipis. It's literally a whole group of them. Alright, so I guess this isn't gonna really work out, to be honest, man. I could call for a backup as well. Oh yeah, okay, excellent hit. So we got a critical. I need to get more uh, more of these shy guy on my team. Maybe I should have had the whole team just, you know. Oh, no, no, deny, 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 deny! I denied him, dude! 
But it didn't work out. I don't think this is going to work out, guys. I might as well have to restart this battle. Let me see if I call for backup what happens. Call for backup. Hey, we got a Paragoomba. But again, that's, that's not going to really work out for me. Like, what's he going to do for me? All right, come on. Kill him. It's just one more Lakitu. No, deny him. We can't. We're out of CP. And he killed my Paragoomba. No, he did it. He's still alive. Dude, Captain, what are you doing? Throw a turn up. Throw a turn up at him. You need to throw a turn up. He's not doing anything, man. He's literally wasting his time. I don't know what my captain's doing. I wish my captain was smarter than that. But at least we killed them all. So victory is ours. As you can see, the only two surviving members on my team were the ones that were able to counteract those Lakitus. But, or Lakapis. This time, this will be easier, I hope. I mean, probably not. They're going to kill all my melees first. So it'll only just be me and my uh, two hammer bros. All right, let's see how much damage we could do. There you go. Oh, yeah, we're actually getting a lot of um, excellent hits on these guys, surprisingly. I don't know how we are, but it's working out pretty nicely. No, deny him. There you go. Oh, all of them are gone. All my melee people are do are gone. Oh, yeah, it's a giant turn up. Kill him. Three. All right. Come on, guys, kill him. There you go, another one. There you go, very nice. Now I know, never again will I have uh, melee guys out here. When it comes to lack of twos, I wasn't expecting that many to be honest. But then again, I should have, I should have, I should have expected that many, considering like the troopies and lack of peas are all flying enemies. All right, victory is ours. Defeated all eight enemies. Post battle exp increased by five percent. What now? Another battle. Okay, there's three battles in this one. Uh oh, it's a whole team now. Final battle. I don't know if we could do it, dude. I really don't know if we could do it this time. I think we can. We we uh, I don't know if we can, dude. I ha I'm not having. I don't have much faith in my team, to be honest. If only my captain was attacking as well, that would have made it a lot easier. Like if he was throwing like um, if he was throwing turnips at these guys, like for real, we could have made this a lot easier for us. But instead, you're making it difficult. At least now he's attacking them. Oh yeah, deny him, deny him. We can't deny him. It's too late for us. Go ahead, throw a turn up. Critical hit. Throw another one. There you go. Oh yeah, very nice. We definitely got this one in the bag. What's he gonna do on me, for real? Super effective. Oh yeah! Critical hit. I was supposed to aim that at it, my bad. But we got another perfect and another additional 5% EXP. So, I'm surprised we made it out of that one alive, to be honest. At least you know my other characters leveled up. Huh. Ah, sucker boy. Master Larry, don't leave us! No! I'm afraid the Kooplings are on Fafel's side. What? No way! They talked a lot of smack, and there they are. The ones that got brainwashed. The Kooplings are brainwashed! Looks like Master Larry was saying the strangest things. He's all He was all like Lord Fafel and that fink rat. How, how could this happen? Well, obviously, Fafel brainwashed him. I hear Cacklet is trying to cock into the Bean Bean Kingdom. Oh, yeah. Dude, this is awesome. Look at this. And now it seems the Kooplings are all working for Fafel. They're already mounting attacks on all areas of the Bean Bean Kingdom. Huh? Honestly, I don't really care what happens to this kingdom. Yeah, it's not your kingdom. You don't live here. I thought we'd stand a chance against Fafel and the Kooplings on our side. I never dreamed they'd join the enemy. It's okay, I've got an idea. We'll beat the Kooplings, knock the washing out of their brains, and recruit them on our side. How? You say that like it's so simple and achievable. I'm not sure how yet, but we'll have to become even stronger than the Kooplings. So, what do you think? I think you're crazy. I don't uh, entirely hate the idea. Yeah, acting without thinking, that's the minion way. Let's follow Captain Goomba's plan. It's our only hope. As for me, I'll go scout out the other minions. We're counting on you, Lakitu. All right, defeat the Kooplings to recruit them and then go rescue Lord Bowser. The minions are determined to stand up to the powerful foe they've never faced before with, uh, will they succeed? Only time will tell. You recruited Lakitu. So we got another new enemy on our team. So we got flying EXP beans. I'm going to go ahead and actually use these. Um, so we got range beans. I'll go ahead and give it to my captain. Can I give it to him? Yeah, I can give it to the, to him. Go ahead, eat it. And then flying bean, I'll give it to I'll give it to him, why not? Okay, so that's pretty good. So what we have here are we have uh, troopies and shy guy. Shy guy are range. So I'm gonna need melee. Hold on, let me think. So how does it work? The circle goes melee counters range, and then flying counters melee. So I need range and melee, I guess, for this battle. 
I have one range, two, three range on the team. Um, hmm, I don't know if I should even use Lakitu. Should I test him out? I think my team as it is is pretty good right now. Uh, however, I do feel like I should be leveling up these guys. But again, it doesn't really seem like it. Like, I need to, considering I have a level 7 Lakitu and I have a level 6. Paragoomba level 5, level 5. So I think we're good. We'll just stick with the same team. Go ahead and begin the next battle. I guess the final battle of the episode. Dun, 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 Lucky 10% for all allies. Oh, yeah. All right, battle number one. Here we go. So the guys in the back will be attacking the flyers. Um, and then my melees will just go in for the melees. Look at that. They're actually also using turnups. That's pretty nice. All right, so there's seven. We have six down. I mean, oh, wow, we are destroying them, dude. Holy crap. No, deny him. There you go. Kill him. All right, as you can see, it's now range versus range. And now that's their captain. There's, he stands no chance against us, obviously. Go ahead, Captain Lack or Shy Guy. Use a turn up. What are you doing, man? Use a turn up, dude. Why aren't you using a turn up? Turn it up. He's not. He's just going to stand there and watch his minions die. There you go. He only attacks when it's like in dire like need. When they're in a condition where they're, they're, they're going to die. Situation where they need him. So yeah, it's the final battle. And it's mainly melee. Alright, that's not good. I should have had some uh, flying guys. But I guess melee will work. Melee, melee on melee. Hopefully I can kill them first. Actually, no, they're ranged. This is, this is pretty nice. I keep forgetting Shy Guy are ranged characters, not melee. It's just because they're ground enemies, I always assume they are. So they're not holding, like, turnips in their hands. But, wow, that was easy. We had seven of our guys still on the battlefield with that victory. Pretty nice. Cleared. Oh, yeah, dude. I love this guy more than the Goomba. And we did it. Everybody leveled up again. I'm level nine. Shy Guy's Captain CP increased by one. And then we got another flag EXP bean. Pretty nice. All right. So, how many levels do we have? We have four, five... Six, seven. Okay, so I guess I didn't realize we had seven. I'll go ahead and do another one. <gasps> Tanumbis and Lakapis. I guess those are, yeah, t t Tanumbas, not Tanumbis. Unless they are called Tanumbis. I could totally see them being called that. I actually don't remember. Um, So what would they be? They would be... I'm trying to think. Would they be melee or range? I'm pretty sure they would be the melee. Because Shy Guy in this area is the range. So, I would... Let me switch out my formation. I'm going to use you, Lakitu. Put you up here. I'm going to use you. Actually, I'm going to use you. I need to level you up. I want to make sure they're all pretty high leveled. So, I got two flyings, two range. No, three range, and then three melee. I think that's good. I feel like I should have three flying. Um, but then again, I don't know. I, we'll try this out. If it doesn't work, it's whatever. I'll just restart the battle. Doesn't really hurt to restart, I guess. Alright, range should be able to attack the aerials. Oh, deny! And then I should be able to just focus on the melees. Oh, yeah. Boom, bada, bing, shalang. Oh, they knocked one of my guys out. Deny him, real quick. They knocked two of my guys out. Maybe this isn't going to work out. Okay, we got a critical hit. Oh, it's working out pretty nicely. Very nice. I right, attack him. He's going for the captain. Save your captain! There you go. Critical hit. Okay, it's working out pretty nicely, guys. We got another deny. Two left on the battlefield. Denied! There you go. Kill him. And now we just need the range on these guys. Oh, excellent hit. Oh, yeah. What the heck? Come on, throw the hammer. That's all it takes. There you go. Wow. Like, it was an instant knockout for both. The captain died and my Goomba died. But at least I survived with two of my range characters on the team. So that's pretty good. I think we could definitely do it with this. So, yeah, I mean, I don't really know, like, how the game really wants you to do it, to be honest. They have the same amount of melee on their team as I do. Um, oh, yeah, there you go. Excellent hit. They took one enemy out first, but usually when I start killing, I, like, kill them all one after another. See, look at that. They had eight, and I was at five, and now we're both equally at five. There you go. Oh, okay. I should have I should have aimed that again. I keep forgetting, and that's what I need to do. So now it's just the range. Oh, they knocked out Lakitu, but it's good. Now it's just aerial and range should be able to take the do the do the do the do 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 do. He killed him. Wow. So now I ended up with just one enemy on or one member on the team. At the end of this, it's getting tougher, man. Tougher and tougher, guys. Come back. 
CP restored by two. Okay, I gotta be wise with how I use these. All right, final battle. This is it. Go in. Woohoo! Attack him. All right, there we go again. Another excellent hit. Just keep throwing those. Oh, deny him. We'll keep denying. Okay. Nope, deny him again. Another critical hit almost. Oh, here comes the captain knocking out my bob bomb. That's not cool, dude. Can't just do that whenever you please. Oh, I can't even deny. That's the thing. And hopefully he doesn't kill him. He did. I knew that was going to happen. I really did. But it's just the captain now. So we should definitely be able to do this. Actually, no, that's not true because he's melee and I'm range. So this is not good. But hopefully I'll be able to. Oh, yeah. There you go. Okay. I didn't move it when I should have moved it. There you go. We killed him. Wow. We barely survived that, dude. Think about it. We started off the first battle with two and uh, uh, two members left on the team, with one member left on the team, and then just with the captain left on the team at the end of this. Whew, but we did it. It's because I put some weak guys in here. And that's why they were like dying instantly. But it's okay because I need to level them up. Look at that. He leveled up to six. I told you. He just he was just very weak. That's all he needed. He needed a chance at leveling up. So let's go ahead and fortify melee um, I guess I'll give it to my captain. I really want to help him out. Oh, yeah, there you go. And then flying, we'll give it to... I gave it to Lakitu last time, but I'm going to give it to this guy. There you go. So, guys, I think that's going to conclude today's episode of Mario & Luigi Bowser's Minions. Next time, we're going to be completing the rest of Bean Bean Kingdom. Um, and as you can see, we have a boss at the end of it. It's the first Koopling. Maybe that's how we recruit them one by one. I don't actually know. Don't spoil it for me. I'm playing this blind. It's very fun, actually. At first, I didn't think I was really going to like it, but I'm going to get into it. Like, just building your own group and team and, and just using different kinds of characters with different abilities. It's very nice. I like it a lot. So I'm excited to see how the rest of this game turns out. Plus, I'm really loving the story, how it unfolds. Fawful has such a huge character um, role in this game. And I love that. It's because he's very important in the other Mario and Luigi games. Maybe not in Partners in Time, but in Bowser's Inside Story, the game is all about him. So I'm glad they made him the like have a huge part of this game as well. So thank you all so much for watching. If you enjoyed, once again, don't forget to drop a like. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out.